Victor has early success, 27 for two. Got caught down at third man in the last game, but he gets it away from that third man. This time for four. That second game, which he got caught at deep third man, he was just looking to guide it. This time he's gone for it. Short outside the off stump, and he's played it very late, almost off the wicket keeper's gloves. Very good shot from the Indian captain. Lovely shot. Good batting from uh, Rusha Pant. Very good. Risk-free batting. Oh, what a shot this is from Virat Kohli. You've seen this a thousand times before. Stand and deliver. Crunches it through the offside. Four of the finest, AJ. Lovely. Oh, goodness. That was sweet from Rusha Pant. All the way for six. Oh, beautiful in the gap. Now we saw at the end of the last over him opening the face. Now he closes the face. We're seeing the best of Virat Kohli in uh, this knock here. Another lovely shot from uh, Richard Pant. We're seeing some of his best work here as well, all the way for another six. 109 for two. Seeing this replay, I guess there were some doubts about the way in which Punty was playing in the series so far, Fort Lauderdale, but he would have been happy. In the gap as well, Fabian Allen is quick, but he's not quick enough. He's an excellent fielder, wholehearted trier, but too much, too good from Virat Kohli, and it brings a 50 for the Indian captain his 21st in T20 internationals <laughs> he's got some shots one of those 360 players in the world game look at this very unorthodox brings up his 50 and fine style this is an amazing innings from the young man matching his captain 50 off just 37 deliveries well, it's gone it's gone to the stumps it's touched the stumps but the bales haven't come off and we've seen that too often even if it hills hits the stumps at full tilt the bales don't seem to come, but this just trickled and touched the stumps. Pulled away with disdain. That's been the nature of this innings from Virat Kohli in full control. Yet another boundary. Virat Kohli has been dismissed against the run of play a very good catch by Evan Lewis full delivery and Evan Lewis made no mistake Virat Kohli dismissed for 59 from 45 it's 133 for three Manish Pandey new batsman in for India he's got a very simple task and this one goes over the fence this is typical Rishabh Pant and like I said before it's not only through the onside he's been scoring in this innings also through the offside the intent still there the aggression still there and that's his strong area and there he goes down the ground that's it what a way to secure yet another win for this Indian team. Very dominant performance by Virat Kohli and his men, Rishabh Pant in particular. Just uh, seeing the final rights in this match and in this series. What a way to end it.
unbeaten on 65 from just 42. Four fours and four sixes. And yet another disappointment for Carlos Bratwit and this West Indies team. So India passing the target with ease. 150 for three in the end. 20 from Rahul at the top, who looked good until he holed out. Shikhar Dawan missed out today. Three from just five. Not the ideal start to the tour for him. But Virat Kohli, who else, with a magnificent 59 from 45. And Rishab Pant put to bed a couple of poor performances in Florida with a brilliant 65 not out from 42, including that glorious straight six to win the game. For the West Indies, two wickets for Thomas at the top, who bowled well. They did really did try hard, the West Indies. Just think they were 20 runs short. Allen with one for 18 from three. Managed 19.1 overs until India knocked off that total. Finished on 150 for three. Well, the player of the match, unsurprisingly, for that three wickets for four runs was Deepak Chahar. And the player of the series for his all-round efforts, Kunal Pandya. Especially his efforts in Florida, I'd say. Ball and bat. Superb series. So in summary, it's been a clean sweep for India. Three matches played, three victories for the Indian touring team. West Indies got 146 for six, but India passed with a plum, 150 for three to win by seven wickets. We hope you've enjoyed our coverage of the highlights. See you shortly.